Hey guys, I'm Zachary Gray, and today we're going to be out here looking for Louisiana milk snakes, one of my favorite snakes. Let's go. Oh my gosh, got one. Oh my goodness. Let me get back out in the open for you guys to see. Oh my gosh, look, 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 oh, he's chomping me. Oh, it's chomping me. This is a Louisiana milk snake. Oh my gosh. Look at him, he is beautiful. Look at the color. Look at that little snake. This is a very small one. Look at the white and the red. Look, he is biting me. Oh, he's biting me. That's good though, that's fine. He is awesome. He is adorable. Oh my goodness. This is my favorite snake. Look at those colors. Oh, he's biting me more. Oh, stop that. You're going to hurt yourself. Oh man, that is so awesome. And where you find one, you find more. So we're going to keep looking for more milk snakes and see if we can find it. Whoop, no, 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 no. No, oh, darn it. <laughs> awesome snake. All right, we're going to keep looking. And this is absolutely incredible. We have all these giant cypress trees, really ancient trees. And this, this old log, this is what milk snakes live in. These old, these old water oak logs. And see that, see how that crumbles apart? This is what they hide in. And since it's getting a little bit cooler, this is what they're gonna be going into and staying in for the winter time. Find them right here, easily. Oh, my goodness, that is a big one. This is a much bigger Louisiana milk than that last one. And he is just as pretty. Oh, look at the tail. Look at his tail going. He is not happy with me. Ooh. He is beautiful. He is big. This is max size for a Louisiana milk. Louisiana milk snakes are a pretty small species of milk snake. So this is full grown. Look at him. He is beautiful. All right, we're gonna get him and that one we caught earlier and show you guys both of these milk snakes. This is absolutely amazing. We have two Louisiana milk snakes right here and they are absolutely beautiful. Look at them. That is outrageous. Now this one is probably only a year old. This is a much smaller one. Very cute, very little, very bright colors. He is outrageously pretty. It would be crazy to see one of these out in the open because most of the time they are hiding under or in logs. They are definitely beautiful. Did you see that? He is trying to bite the other snake. Now these snakes are actually cannibalistic and I'm not sure if he's doing that out of fear or if he's actually trying to eat the other snake, but they are technically king snakes. Both of these are actually a kind of king snake, so that means that they will eat other snakes that they can overpower. And it's a super strong snake. Look at it. Alright, now we went and put the little one away because they were actually trying to bite each other. So here we're just going to show the larger one. Now, you can see the beautiful colors on this snake, but there is a venomous species of snake that actually has the red and black banding, and it is a coral snake. Now, the coral snake in this area has the yellow banding so a milk snake that's a way you can tell with Louisiana milks is that they have white instead of yellow as well as if you've ever heard the nursery rhyme red on black venom black red on yellow kill a fellow that means if you can see the red banding is touching the black banding on the Louisiana milk and on the, uh, the coral snake the red will be touching the yellow and that means it's a venomous snake. This is a non-venomous species. A lot of people would say, oh, it's a brightly col colored snake. That is dangerous. No, that is not true at all. But it does mimic the coral snake, so a lot of times people will think that it is a coral snake, which is pretty cool. Now, out here, I'm guessing that his main diet would consist of skinks, ground skinks, five-line skinks, and also other snakes, the little ringneck snakes that we find around here, maybe even a little 
earth snake or anything like that, that's what they'll eat because they will eat other snakes. Very beautiful snake and oftentimes does very well in captivity, but this is maximum size, so a lot of people prefer the larger, larger species of milk snakes as pets, but I still think that this is the most amazing snake out here. It's awesome. This is the little baby Louisiana milk snake, and his colors are a lot more vibrant than the adult. You can see the white is much brighter. The other one is more like a light gray, but he's got the much brighter white. Let me see if I can flip him over, and you can see that the patterns don't go all the way to the belly, and that's something on coral snakes as their bands go all around, but milk snakes do not. Their belly will not have the bands that go all the way around, which is kind of neat. Oh man, he's so little and he's really soft and fragile. Very fragile little snake and just completely beautiful. This is something that you do not always get to see. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you did enjoy, definitely leave a like and I will see you guys next time.